G'day guys, it's Ralph Mayhew here from Video Prop Converter and today we're looking at how you convert a video into 60 frames a second. That's right, 60 frames a second. Now why would you need to do that? Because 60 frames a second is the optimum frames per second ratio to capture as much action as possible. So whether you're going out for a surf, you're going out for a mountain bike, you're doing other extreme sports, 60 frames a second enables you to capture the most action and the most clarity. So that's what we're doing and we can use Video Prop Converter to do this. It's completely free and today you can get yours in the description below. Totally free, unlimited. Yours today, just use the link. It will take you to this download page. Once you're there, click on this button. That will enable you to download the program and then install it. Once it's installed, open it up. Once you're looking at the menu, you click video and it opens up this option. You have two ways to import your video. You can click the video plus button to import it manually or you can just drag and drop the file you want in. This is some GoPro footage at 30 frames a second. Once that's fully imported, which takes no time at all, you then select video down here and that gives you a number of formats you can choose from to export your footage. This is 4K footage, so I'm going to choose 4K and then we go to the codec cog that is above OPT. We click on that. We make sure format is selected in the top left hand menu. Then we go down to frame rate, FPS, and we get to choose 60 frames a second. Once we've choose that, we can click done because it calculates the target bitrate all by itself. If you have a number of files, you can click apply to all and it makes them all 60 frames a second, but we have only one file today. So we're just gonna go with that. Gonna hit done. It's going to bring that up and we are about to export. But what you need to know is WMV and MPEG-2 both cannot export at more than 30 frames a second. So if you're looking to use either of those formats, you won't be able to export at 60 frames a second, but you can on all the others. So once you've done that, you click run. And here's the result. Here's the original 30 frames a second next to the 60 frames a second video out of the GoPro camera. What's your preferred result? What's your preferred frame rate? Please let us know in the comments below. If you have any other questions, we'd love to see you there. Thanks so much for watching. We'd appreciate a subscribe if you've been enjoying this content. Give us a thumbs up and we'll see you in the next video. Cheers. Bye.